checking off a bucket list one stadium at a time. Hey guys, welcome back to Garrett Stadium Travel. Today's stadium vlog number six. This was a spontaneous trip. We are driving from London, Ontario to Detroit, Michigan. We are going to see the Detroit Tigers play the Seattle Mariners tonight. Should be an awesome game. The Seattle Mariners are one of the hottest teams in baseball. We got Matthew here in the back. Great we got baseball. Ryan driving us. Um, yeah, we're gonna show you guys, obviously Comerica Park, Ford Field's right beside. Should be super awesome. Uh, we're gonna pick it up when we're a little closer. Let's go. We're here at Comerica Park, and it's time for the stadium fact of the day. Today's stadium fact, we are on it actually. This is a carousel. As you can see, we are inside the park. This is uh, the only thing of its kind in the MLB, and we're doing it. So if you're ever at Comerica Park, check this out. It's a super cool area with different, different places to eat, and we're having fun on this thing. Uh, we're gonna enjoy a great game, let's go. Hey, fist bump, fist bump, let's go. Oh. Right here, right here. Thank you, thank you. Gave proof through the night that our flag was still there. Where even is it, dude? Oh, damn, right here. Woo! What a play. That was freaking sick. Let's go. Watch for the first hitter. Yeah. I don't care if I ever It's a final here. The Detroit Tigers got blown out by the Seattle Mariners. Uh, good game nonetheless though, a couple home runs from the Mariners. Uh, great game, we got a two hour drive back home 
and then uh, I'll pick it up and I'll tell you guys what I saw. Hey guys, we're back. It was about two hours home. The Mariners ended up winning nine to three. It was a good game. Offense from both sides. The Mariners, obviously superior. I mean, they're in the playoff race. Detroit isn't, so there was that. First thing I'm gonna do is show you guys what I got from this game. Uh, the first thing we got, just kind of given to us by this guy on the street, this America lapel pin. I'm Canadian, so I don't know how many times I'm gonna be wearing this, but I guess kind of cool. Uh, the next one, our seats were winners, so we got this Detroit Tigers koozie. Again, not a Detroit Tigers fan, so I'm not sure exactly when I'm going to be using this, but, you know, cool. And then this one from the team store, this is kind of cool. It is a Comerica Park, Michigan uh, State outlined magnet. I'll probably be putting this on my fridge in my dorm is probably where I'm going to put it, so that's kind of cool. And then the collector cup. Tigers Baseball 2022 with the logo and all that on it. Uh, pretty cool. And last but not least, we have this cool reusable bag that says Comerica Park on it. Again, not exactly sure what I'm gonna use this for, but we will find a purpose for it. So again, Mariners win 9-3 over the Detroit Tigers. So what I saw from Comerica Park, this place is pretty cool. For a city that doesn't have the greatest sports teams, they have gorgeous stadiums in my opinion. It was a gorgeous night. Uh, the Comerica Park has this sort of vibe to it that a lot of other baseball stadiums that I have been to don't have. The Tigers that are shown in the videos all around are a super cool touch. And yeah, they got all their stadiums in the same district. They have Ford Field and Little Caesars Arena right there. It's super cool. Some things that, that kind of stood out to me were in this concession area, they had little bottles of, I believe it was aspirin, uh, headache medicine, sinus medicine, all that kind of stuff, which is kind of cool. I've never seen that. So if you are having a headache at a game, you can go and purchase, although the prices I'm sure are obscene. I didn't check. Uh, if that ruins or was going to ruin your experience, then in that case, it wouldn't. Uh, the concession prices were pretty standard, expensive as always. Uh, the hot dog prices were absolutely insane, but they did have Little, Cedar, Little Caesars Pizza, excuse me, which is pretty cool. The headquarters is actually in downtown Detroit, which I wasn't actually aware of, but it's really cool. Detroit style deep dish pizza. Did not know it was a thing, but it is pretty good. Uh, we got front row tickets, which was super fun. The one thing about the Detroit Tigers is that they are not very good right now. They are around the bottom of the American League which means that tickets are cheap. We got front row tickets just past first base on the first base side for, I believe it wasn't too much over like $35, which is perfect. It was easy getting in, easy getting out. Parking was $25, which is a little bit up there, but for the most part, it was a really, really pleasant experience in a city that is you know, labeled to be one of the more dangerous, dangerous in America. We had absolutely no problems. Everybody was friendly, so yeah, I would give Comerica Park maybe a five or six on the scale. I think that fan atmosphere is a big problem, but you do get kind of a free pass on that. But for the most part, everything was pretty solid. So definitely I'd give it a six out of 10. So yeah, this was a super fun and spontaneous day. Uh, ended in baseball, which is super cool. This was my first uh, ballpark vlog. So stay tuned for hopefully more of those in the future. And as always, I'm checking off a bucket list one stadium at a time. I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.